Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to Adventure FPV. My name is Lee. If you're new to the channel, welcome. So I'm kind of having an internal struggle with flying and uh, what I'm doing. I'm trying to figure out if I'm just a giant wuss or extremely sensible. So I bought the uh, GEP RC Smart 3.5 uh, to kind of pair with my Baby Hawk 2. It's, you know, kind of a small quad, uh, 3.5 inch, uh, something I wanted to just bash around a little bit more than the 5 inch. I'm not really super comfortable bashing around a 5 inch yet. Uh, I've been flying for about five months. I started flying more cruising and long range with the Crimera 4, and then I got a Protec 25, and I was doing some Cinewoop stuff. And I didn't really get a 5 inch until about three months into my journey. And I love it. But I am a little bit nervous when it comes to, you know, doing, like, bashing around and trying to be, like, Bubby FPV or Mr. Steel or something. I love that kind of stuff, but I really haven't been able to find myself able to push myself to that kind of level. And I, I'm trying to figure out if it's just that I'm scared uh, of doing it or if I am just being sensible because I have money on the line. I'm not a sponsored channel. I self-fund myself and I really enjoy keeping my stuff together in one piece um, and making good content for you guys. But uh, yeah, uh, like I said, I got this quad because I wanted to push my limits a little bit more. I drove past this park several times now um, and I see it's under construction. I'm like, man, I need to get over there and rip this thing. And uh, yeah, so today I, I had a chance to actually stop by and do it, and there was several times today where I was like, yeah, this would be dope, this uh, this iron uh, structure that's going up here, I'm gonna rip through it, power loop it, come down through the top, and then when it comes down to it, I, I don't. <laughs> I get a little nervous, I, I bail. Uh, I have a perfect shot coming down right in the top of the, uh, the structure, and it's like, nope, mm -mm, not gonna do that. Uh, but I'll do it in the simulator all day long and I'm getting pretty good at it. So I don't know I think it's just a part of growing uh, uh, Like I said acro really wasn't where I started and it really isn't my intention of flying FPV. I, re I really like to make um, polished like high-quality videos um, Color graded I want it to look smooth. I want it to look nice um, You know so it acro really wasn't my thing obviously if you can get really good at being a good acro freestyle or flow pilot, it's only going to add to your toolbox uh, when you're doing other types of work. I do a lot of client work uh, with the DJI stuff. I've been a professional drone pilot since 2013, uh, late 2013, and... Uh, yeah, so I do a lot of that stuff. I've, I, I've been on many, many client jobs over the years, but I only started flying FPV about five months ago. And yeah, I don't know. I, I'm just kind of venting, talking out loud here. I want to see what you guys think about it. Uh, maybe you can leave a comment down below and tell me how you feel about it or when you started getting a little more brave. And I don't know. I just, I feel like that if I don't want to smash something into the ground that I just bought or just built or put together uh, and risk a camera and everything and I know that if you're not crashing you're not hitting stuff you're not pushing yourself but I feel like I am pushing myself um, in, in different ways I, I am pushing the limits but maybe not uh, nose diving from a hundred feet through a metal girder into concrete um, that would definitely be pushing yourself but it m may also just in my day so anyway i just wanted to talk to you guys and uh, see what you thought about it i i am uh i am trying to advance and learn as much as i can um but i think there's just a limit on it for me i don't know how you guys feel about it i'd be interested to hear um i'm sure some people are like send it just smash it it's just money can't take it with you and other people are going to be like yeah no i you know have a limited budget i'm not gonna smash my gear just for the sake of testing um but anyway uh, i just want to talk to you guys this is a cool park for sure uh, i'm gonna have to come back and maybe try and rip it one more time uh before it gets completed and definitely when it's completed it'll be really dope but of course there's gonna be people here so you gotta get it here early but uh yeah thank you guys for watching i really appreciate all your support if you haven't subscribed to the channel please do so this is the shameless plug um, and also, hey guys, if you want to support my channel, you can check out my website, adventurefpv.com. I have tons of like uh, pilot resources. I have my rates. I have uh, camera settings and lots of information for new pilots and experienced pilots. Uh, I really come from a video editing uh, background. 
So, um, you know, I may have experience there that you don't. You maybe you're a better, you're probably a better pilot than me, but uh, you may not have as much uh, experience with video editing. I've been doing it since 2013. Um, so I may have something to offer there, but I also sell t-shirts. If you guys want to buy something, you can click an affiliate link in the description. And even if you don't buy one of the products that I'm uh, posting there, if you buy anything, once you click my affiliate link, I do get a small commission and it would help my channel grow. And you know what? Maybe if my channel grew a little bit and I had some extra money, I'd send that mother. No, <laughs> just smash it in the ground. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, no, I really do appreciate you guys. Uh, my followers on the channel have been great so far. Uh, most of the people who watch my content are not subscribed, so um, definitely subscribe. I have a, lot, a mixture of content here. I have stuff like uh, client work. I have just really polished videos. I do Insta360 stuff. I do uh, a lot of iFlight drones, Emac stuff. I just got this GEP RC Smart 3.5. So anyway, definitely check it out. I love you guys. Thanks for watching.